Two weeks from tonight, we'll be showing you results from our state's primary election. A record number of absentee ballots are expected for the August 4th primary because many voters do not want to go to the polls in a pandemic. Tonight, 13 On Your Side's Amar Abbas shows us a new tracking system that addresses concerns about voter fraud and lets voters know the status of their ballots. Everybody is always worried about absentee ballots. Walker City Clerk Sarah Bidelex says those concerns are even greater this year due to COVID. We are definitely statewide at 60% request for absentee ballots, which is even going to grow for November. In 2018, voters approved a new law that allowed anyone in the state to vote absentee. The record numbers expected this year has Walker, Grand Rapids Township, Cannon Township, and Lansing trying a new system for absentee called Track My Ballot. This system allows us to see the mail go through the post office from the clerk to the voter and from the voter back to the clerk. On the absentee ballot envelope is a track my ballot website that they can go to and they can put their name in and track their ballot when it comes from the city of Walker. Here in Walker, city leaders say the new system won't necessarily reduce workload, but it will create peace of mind. So by them being able to guarantee that we've received that ballot, to me, is a great asset. If it works, many more Michigan cities could use the system in November that organizers believe will prevent fraud. There's been a lot of talk about how vote through the mail is uh, fraught with problems and uh, fraud um, issues, and we can completely prevent that with this system because we can see the mail traveling um, from the clerk to the voter and from the voter back. So we see every scan. In Walker, I'm Boss, 13 on your side.